Hi guys in another video by MTech Pro, it's way too soon to be sure of what the Galaxy S21 might bring to the table. It has only been a couple of months since Samsung launched the Galaxy S20 lineup, but that obviously doesn't mean that work isn't already underway on next year's flagship. The latest leaks out of Taiwan is that Samsung is testing some rather interesting camera specs for its 2021 flagship. It may be looking to eliminate some of the pain points that Galaxy S20 Ultra customers have complained about. The Galaxy S20 Ultra's camera suffered from a few issues right out the gate. It would particularly struggle with focusing on the subject. While the company has fixed many of the issues through subsequent firmware updates, it just wasn't a good look for its top-of-the-line flagship. Samsung is now said to be changing the Galaxy S21 camera specs, with laser autofocus seemingly being dropped. One of the current development models is rumored to sport a 150-megapixel main sensor, with a 64-megapixel telephoto, 16-megapixel wide-angle, and a 12-megapixel macro sensor. Some earlier reports have suggested that Samsung might drop the TOF sensor as early as this year for the Galaxy Note 20, but it's listed as part of the setup for the Galaxy S21. It seems that there are two versions being tested, the first one would have optical image stabilization on the main telephoto sensor, and the selfie camera, while the other version would have voice in the telephoto and the wide-angle camera. Now, the macro camera is usually found in Samsung's Galaxy A series, but it could very well find its way to the next Galaxy S21 flagship. In another leaks the Galaxy S21 is expected to rely on the prowess of Qualcomm's upcoming Snapdragon 875 SOC, at least in markets where it won't be equipped with an Exynos chipset instead. Although this early apparent leak doesn't detail any exact numbers in terms of core counter frequencies, the source claims that the Snapdragon 875 will be equipped with new Cryo 685 cores, likely 8 of them. As expected, the SOC will also be integrated with Qualcomm's X65G modem. But the tech giant gave up on its custom cores, and the next chipset is also said to be using AMD graphics, so it could be a strong contender. So all these leaks are important, they give us what the Galaxy S21 will look like and how strong it is. Thanks for watching, and see you in another video, don't forget like and subscribe, share if you liked.